Good evening and welcome to Night Prayer. As we gather at the end of this day, coming again to the Lord who loves us, the Lord who is for us, the God who says, yes, I love you and delight in you. So let's take a moment to be still, knowing that God welcomes us in these moments at this time. A verse from Psalm 131, verse 3. O Israel, put your hope in the Lord, now and always. The Lord Almighty grant us a quiet night and a perfect end. Our help is in the name of the Lord, who made heaven and earth. The one who made heaven and earth is our help. He's been with us through this day, helping us whether we've seen him or not. So take a moment to reflect and bring to him the joys and the sorrows and the frustrations of this day. Save us, O Lord, while waking, and guard us while sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep may rest in peace. I'm thinking about bless, and how we can pray for others as well as for ourselves. We come to E for emotions. And that we have that well-known verse, from John 11 verse 35 when Jesus met the women at Lazarus's tomb Jesus wept emotions can sometimes have such a negative connotation when people can say they're so emotional and all their emotions are out of control but yet our emotions matter they're God-given, the extremes that we have, but also the everyday things, joy, laughter, frustration, irritation, happiness. All of these matter. They're part of us. And when we are stuck in our emotions, God knows and God cares. He knows when we don't know what to do. He knows when we're overtired. He knows when we're um, overwhelmed with grief. And he understands and comes alongside us. Ecclesiastes talks about there being a time for everything. And so in those times when our emotions are good, bad, whatever, in fact, I would usually say emotions don't have a good or a bad. They are there to tell us something. Let's remember that God knows. And as we bring our own emotions to God, whatever today has held, pray too for the emotions and the emotional life of those that you care for. For God is there with them in those places too. And he can break through to bring life. So let's pray. Holy God, you have given us emotions. You pour in your love into those places where we need to know it and our loved ones and friends need to know it. In places where we're stuck, let your spirit flow to unstick us and to bring us life. We pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Visit this place, O Lord, we pray, and drive far from it the snares of the enemy. May your holy angels dwell with us in peace. 
and may your blessing be always upon us. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. And we pray the Lord's Prayer together. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. In peace we will lie down and sleep. For you alone, O Lord, make us dwell in safety. And the blessing. From this day on, from this unremarkable hour, from this moment history will not record, God's blessing comes to you. Amen. Bless you and sleep well. <laughs>